Hey guys, thanks for stopping in to pause for a moment of science. Today I want to talk about inertia. Uh, inertia is the common name for Newton's first law and I just want to um, talk about it real quick and then show you a really good way to remember it and I promise you will never forget it. So, um, inertia is just a tendency to keep doing what an object is already doing. So Newton will say that an object at rest will stay at rest and an object at motion will stay in motion unless an outside force acts upon it. And so in more simple terms, what that means is if I have a ball and I place it here, and I'll just move this other one out of the way, it will stay there and stay there and stay there until some type of force makes it move. So that force might be from the wind. It might be from my hand. There will be some kind of force that will put the ball in motion and change its position. But if there is no force acted upon it, Newton says that inertia will make it stay exactly where it is. Now, the flip side of that is inertia also says that if it's moving, it's going to keep moving. So if the ball is rolling, Inertia says it will continue to roll and roll and roll unless some kind of force acts upon it and, and stops its position or its change of motion. And so that force could be friction from the surface, it could be um, air resistance of the air, it could be a kid kicking it, it could be, you know, any other type of force can change its position or its direction. All right, the best way that I have to explain inertia is using this thing right here. What would you call it? Right, seat belt. What it should be called is inertia belt. Everything you ever wanted to know about inertia can be explained with a seat belt. I'm going to demonstrate inertia with seat belts and more importantly seat belt safety. This is my husband Pete and I just have to tell you number one do not try this at home and number two as a disclaimer no husbands were injured in the filming of this inertia lesson. All right so right now what we're going to do is we're going to demonstrate inertia using the seat belts and remember inertia says that if an object is still it's going to stay still until there is some type of force. Well right now our bodies are at rest. Our bodies are sitting still and they're going to stay sitting still until some kind of force moves them. Well, in today's lesson, the first force that we're going to use is going to be the accelerator, otherwise the gas pedal on the car. So what I'm going to do is I am going to increase the speed on the car and what will happen is our bodies will want to stay at rest. So you'll notice what happens when I hit the gas. Ah! And the brake. 